Hello guys, Milo34 again. Uh, there goes my buddy, he just flew to the moon. I'm joined by my uh, new co-host for uh, Gary's Mod. His name is... What is his name? What's your name, buddy? Scalor. Scalor, thank you. Never been good at Scalor. saying your name. Anyways, Scalor, uh, Scalor right, is gonna... Are. Uh, what? Check, look at the skybox. Fuck skybox. the skybox. Hi. Holy you shit. you see me? <laughs> <laughs> He's huge! I see you! <laughs> so that's Scalor up there. He's, uh, I guess, nerd when it comes to uh, Gary's mod. Stop flying, dude. Frickin' massive <laughs> conqueror of buildings. Scalor, the, uh, the giant. Or Godzilla, for All those right, of you who are Chinese. Scalor, come down here, dude. <laughs> Alright, I'm low. So there's Scalor. Thanks for whacking into right. me, Scalor. You see this You're in my head? I can do much worse. Oh! I guess it doesn't nope. matter. <laughs> <laughs> you see it? All see right. it? So see it? What you are we working with? No, it's an error for me. It's an error? Well, it don't much matter. I don't have Counter Strike Source. Oh, okay. Ouch. Anyways, uh... Yeah, if I had Counter-Strike Source, I would be able to see it fine. Yeah, uh, create yourself... I, w I want you to, s to build a... No, that's mine. Uh, I want you to build a house, Scalor. I, I don't care how you build a house. Don't upload one. Make make a new one for this, because I want you to be busy while I uh, run the people through how to create this. While you explain it. Yeah, because it's going to take a while. Anyways, I'm going to keep this up for you guys. Oh, well, can't. hey? I can't troll through the skybox. You do what? So I can't troll through the sky. No, please don't through the, uh, troll sky through the sky box. Box. <laughs> Just, just <laughs> build the thing, dude. <laughs> Alright. So yeah, we, uh... uh How big? It, it make as nice of a house as you want, because this is going to take me a little while to run through and recreate. Uh... Right, so I'll as most... Hey? Six by six. Yeah. He's going to make, make it... a six by six. He's going to make a large porta potty um... <laughs> Scalor, uh... he's um, he's gonna be one of the co-hosts for my uh... my gmod series and uh... yeah this is definitely a change of pace for me as most of you guys know all i really do or really play is gary... or not gary's mod uh... grand theft auto and now all i really play is gary's mod and uh... waiting for battlefield to come out and I'm gonna be doing a lot more YouTube videos for you guys, so please, if you're just tuning in and this is your first time ever watching my video, or ever watching any of my videos, check out my content and stay tuned because I'm gonna be doing a lot more Gary's Mod stuff. Uh, uh, people who you know who watch um, YouTube or like Gary's Mod or you know are being into this kind of stuff, dude, you're gonna have to make a really awesome house because my introductions are normally really long. <laughs> Um, all right, I, all right, I can, I can do that. Uh, what was I saying? Oh yeah, and uh, if you have any friends who are trying to learn Gary's mod, keep them coming back to my channel because I want YouTube to pay me. I'm a greedy bastard. And uh, this guy over here, our new co-host, <laughs> he, uh, as well as the rest of my team, uh, you guys possibly, if you want to join on, still taking applications, uh, can get in on this. Um, however, you know it's going to be kind of hairy. I, I normally do read some of my fan mail, but a lot of my fan mail just goes directly into the garbage can because uh, you name your messages retarded shit or stuff that uh, doesn't really grab my attention. Anyways, uh, back to what I'm doing. I'm going to be showing you guys how to make a working keypad. This thing outputs a value of 1 in wire mod so you can open doors or you can set the value to whatever the hell you want. So let's type in Scalor's code because that's what I saved it with for his door. Sorry Scalor, everybody knows your code now so you're going to have to find a new one. Uh, and then it puts a value of 1, clear it, it puts a value of 0, equal chip, that adds up everything, and for some reason it always reads a random code after, but um, it's not really there. Uh, you're going to need to make an E2 addition chip for this because the normal addition chip doesn't have enough values for 9. E2 is really difficult for some people. For coders it should be very easy not for you me. guys. Shut up, dude. You can't make anything in E2 yet. 
<laughs> you want to bet? Well, you can, can make more than I can. can. Upload my. No, it's okay. I can upload my uh, gun shop. Do you want me to upload my gun shop? Make a giant screen over here too that just. Well, I don't. I don't know. Surprise me with something interesting. Not something that's going to take up a hell of a lot of space, or else I'm going to start to lag, and I can't lag while recording because then it's just a bitch to like edit. Anyways, um, addition chip E2. Uh, that's fairly easy to do. Um, Scalor, apparently he's the master of E2. Been doing it for how many days? Two days? No, Three I'm days? not. Uh, <laughs> go to hell. <laughs> no, Scalor's, Scalor's fairly smart. He's smarter than I am. He knows a little bit more about E2 than I do. Uh, I've been playing this for about two weeks, so I uh, I don't really know all that much. But uh, it's good to have somebody who's good with E2 and he knows what he's doing. So thank you, Scowler, for joining me no, and uh, being as awesome as you are. <laughs> thank you very much. And that's about all the things you're going to get from me ever. <laughs> so back to <laughs> prop building. Um, for most of you guys, you're going to want to have the PHX as well as WireMod. And those guys, I guess, have pretty much teamed up in their downloads. and You can get them both really simply. Um, do a couple of YouTube searches and I'm sure you'll find something uh, that'll help you out and that's uh, that's how I got what I got over here um, I love the PH right, um. I love the PHX uh, some. super flat boxes because they're really really nice for making keypads or whatever the hell, whatever the hell else you want to make uh, you're gonna need wire mod for this you don't need PHX but I suggest it because almost every server uses it now wire mod is pretty much everything that you're seeing on the back here. This might not be the most efficient way of doing this. I, I know it definitely isn't because you can make an E2 chip that does all of this. It saves you tons of time. But, uh, as far as as far as, I, I don't know, as, as wire mod is, new people are, uh, this would be the way I suggest you guys go. What the hell does that say, dude? That's way too small. Uh, I'm making it bigger. <laughs> okay. You have to make it rainbow too. Um, so back to building. Uh, let's God start out with the buttons on the panel because that's the simplest thing to do. So you want to go into wire mod, and I guess I'll call this the wire mod directory for the rest of all time until I actually find out what it's called. Um, go into in out or. Um, open close kind of thing uh, you can use normal size buttons if you really want to they're fairly large I, I'm gonna use the small ones just because uh, the small ones you know they just work better for keypad Fuck, I hate the fizz gun in this <laughs> all right so small Almost done fixing the size issue Got one more line of coding to make. Okay. One. If any of you guys right, happen to know out. the uh, the code or the uh, the uh, add-on for little grid over an object, or if it was like a smart snap. Is that smart snap? Is that what it's called? Yeah, it's yeah. it's a view thing that that appears over top of this. Does it come with wire mod or PHX, by chance? I think it comes with a uh, PHX. I'm not sure though. Okay, well, so I have both. All, All right, right, there you go. Made a sign. Yeah, hey, hey, made a simple ass sign. <laughs> for Valhalla, for Asgard, for honor, for victory. There you go. Super nerdy, but thank you. That will You're be welcome. the title of our video. No, actually, I couldn't make the title of our video. <laughs> uh, I'll add it somewhere in the comments or the description or some shit. <laughs> the tags. Yeah, I'll add it in the tags. Alright, alright. Sounds good. <laughs> the hell's that from, anyways? From Lord of the Rings? What, the... No? Did you just Valhalla make that up? is Nordic. Uh, basically, yeah. Okay. Very good. How's how's our house coming? I won't look over. Um, well, I'll be pleasantly or unpleasantly surprised. 
Well, after having to adjust my uh, sign, it's a little falling behind, but anyway. That's okay. Don't rush. Make Shit. it as nice as possible. That's why I have precision alignment. It makes things nice. Yeah, no, aren't you happy that I installed it? Actually, yes, I am. It makes things so oh, much nicer. Oh, yeah, it nicer. does. Precision alignment, one of those really, really, really important tools that you might want to download. Uh, it took me about 15 minutes to find, and, and that might even be an overstatement because it wasn't all that difficult. Uh, it's, uh, it's one of those tools that just allows you to connect things and make things connect really easily. And, uh, straight. Exactly, straight. And it... Yeah, it's like perfect. <sighs> Gotta love lemonade. Did you buy it from a lemonade stand? No. no homemade. Homemade. I don't know if it's better than yep. from a stand or not. It is. I've ever, I bought children's lemonade before in a stand just because. Yeah, it, it wasn't all that good. Mm, no, it only isn't. No offense to all of the uh, people who do that for. Oh a living. no, it, it did. <laughs> yeah, for all those for all those kids who do that for a living. Okay, now I'm gonna go into small. Remember, things. add flavors. No, don't add flavors. I don't need you peeing in a cup. <laughs> anyway. Oh, quite what I meant. Hey, um, is there a prop limit or no? No, I have everything set to like 512. Somebody told me that that was the limit for everything. So just, you know, uh, don't ridiculously right. spawn. Sweet. Over spawn stuff. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm not. Okay, we're gonna have to re- uh, I'm gonna have to restart this server, so... <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Alright, well, let me weld everything. Yeah, weld, weld it and save it. And then it. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Why do you have to restart it? Apparently, my wire mod button's limit has already been hit after 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 buttons. <laughs> or 9 buttons. And I thought I set everything up so I wouldn't have this issue, but apparently not. That's okay, because stuff doesn't seem to save. I don't know why. Let's save this to server as what the fuck confused my low. Oh wait, no wait. Never mind. Never mind. It's okay. It's okay. Actually, we don't have to. We don't have to leave. All I have to do is just as I progress through, delete the wire mod buttons on the back of this. Just so you guys know, this is how many wire mod buttons you can actually use after using this on most servers that don't have it set up for more than this as max. Because this thing takes up so much space. <laughs> so as long as you don't go over uh, nine more buttons after this is placed, you're okay. So yeah, don't worry, dude. It's okay. I just have to remove all these buttons in the front here. And then I have to do some thinking and make sure that everything is okay. proper. I have to remember how to do this now. Oh, fuck. I hate using my brain. I'm tempted to make it a three-story. Do it! I'm tempted to make it three-story. Do it. Okay. You know what I'm saying, that just to get me working. Do it! <laughs> no, I, I'm just saying that because I don't expect right, to be done right, very I'm soon. On it. Yeah, no, I understand. Okay, so we'll hmm. the. I'm actually going to have to be very creative with this part. It unfolds from a little box. I really think that you should do that, dude. That that's a really good idea. What? Uh, your house thing that Do you what? were challenged by that admin to to build. Oh God, no! Do it. I, no. That would be so that sick. That shit is basic. I know it would, but God, that shit's near impossible. So basically, the challenge was for all you YouTube viewers listening. Um, it I was challenged by an admin of a server that I play on a lot. Uh, Fusion RP, um, it's powered by Griffin Run, but, uh, an admin <laughs> Yeah, dude, don't, don't, don't advertise, because we're not getting paid for our advertisements. <laughs> Fuck them! <laughs> <laughs> but, um, <laughs> but, um, an admin challenged me to basically...